A lot of people are worried about their bank these days. While devastated giants like Citigroup get bailed out again and again and again, many smaller banks are failing, failing, failing. I'm very angry, very upset about this. I wanted to withdraw my money. Uh, I've got a CD. I've got about approximately $100,000. This is no recovery, and this I know for sure. Risky loans and the amount of debt has all America broke. Are you happy? Are you satisfied? You screwed the economy. I don't care if you think you're rich. You're owned by the FDIC. There's no bank that I could trust because another, another bank bites the dust. dust. You better get your fuck before your bank goes bust because another, another bank bites the dust. And another one's gone, another one's gone, another bank bites the dust. But Nike, we're gonna get you too, another bank bites the dust. How do you think we gon' get along without you giving loans? Took me for everything that I had, kicked me out of my home. Are you happy? Are you satisfied? You screwed the economy. I don't care if you think you're rich. You're owned by the FDIC. There's no bank that I could trust because another bank bites the dust. You better get your bucks before your bank goes bust because another bank bites the dust. And another one's gone, another one's gone, another bank bites the dust. Bernanke, we're gonna get you to another bank fights the dust. Yeah, the one-time mortgage giant is the latest victim of the mortgage meltdown. A week ago, the lender laid off more than half its employees. By Friday, its stock was virtually worthless. We were told we would get in. We Stay open an extra hour! When IndyMac failed, you were watching these scenes on television yes, of I people was. lining up outside the bank like it was 1932. Yes, it was. It was what amazing. did you think of that? So I think people just forgot that banks do fail and how the FDIC works. What sort of hit was that on your balance sheet? I think we ended up to, uh, it was over $9 billion for a $33 billion. Yes, it was very stiff. The question becomes, how many times can the FDIC do that? At what point is the FDIC broke? How many times can the FDIC do that? At what point is the FDIC broke? The FDIC is backed by the full faith and credit of the United States government. So if we need to, we try not to and don't want to, but if we need to, we can borrow from Treasury to... Uh... The Fed is paying banks higher interest rates now to keep their funds parked at the Fed instead of loaning the money to the American people. Is that not true? Yes. So the FDIC never goes broke? We don't go broke. No, we're, we are the government. We're backed by the full faith and credit of the United States government. There's no bank that I could trust because another one bites the dust. You better get your bucks before your bank goes bust because another one bites the dust. And another one's gone, another one's gone, another one bites the dust. Geithner, we're gonna get you too. Another one bites the dust. Gotta, gotta get your money. You gotta, gotta get your money. The FDIC says it has a list of 90 troubled banks around the country. And believe it or not, the Indy Mac Bank here wasn't even on the list.